Everyone wants to be motivated, but you ain't always going to be motivated. You got to be disciplined because motivation, you put it, you know, you, you listen to this song or you come out of a seminar and you're like, yeah, baby. Yeah, I'm flying. I'm, I'm enjoying myself. Next day, you ain't, you ain't going to want to do it. You got to be disciplined, but you got to enjoy that discipline. You got to enjoy. And I understand that now. And I'm more disciplined because of that. I enjoy that. I might not always be motivated, but I enjoy that I'm the one holding myself accountable and I'm putting in that hard work, I'm putting in that discipline because I know that's what's gonna get me to where I wanna be. I think, to go on top of that, motivation is fleeting, motivation is temporary. I used to look at like motivational videos like Eric Thomas and shit, because yeah. I was looking for sparks. Same. Right? But that taught me a good mental framework, but at the same time, it taught me to be reliant on outside external circumstances to trigger me. At the end of the day, when you're alone running those hills, at the Kokoda Trail on a thousand steps, you're only by yourself. Exactly. You only got yourself. I have to drive longer than I'm fucking running. So it wouldn't make doesn't make much sense, does it? I'm I'm takes me double, triple the amount of time to get there in travel time than it is to actually do the thing. What the fuck? Why are you doing that? It's a waste of time. No, that is what is needed to do what I need to do to be disciplined. Now you say you got to. Maybe for you, you enjoy the discipline. I don't even think people need to enjoy discipline. I just think you need to be disciplined. That's true. You may not enjoy it. It doesn't matter because discipline is doing what you, what you have to do when you're supposed to do it, regardless of how you feel. That is true. I don't want to fucking lift and exercise every day. Yeah. It's hard, man. But I have to fucking do it. Exactly. Because if I don't, then internally, I regress. I die. I, 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 I become... A much less effective human being. And I think what I was trying to say is that Whew. you might not enjoy it in that moment, yeah. but enjoy that once you, you're making progress, you enjoy that you put yourself through that. You respect yourself, yeah. respect yourself, love yourself and be fulfilled with yourself that you've put, you've put in that work. You went on the days that you just sat there and you said, Fuck, I don't want to do this. But you did it anyway. You did it anyway. You won the day. You won the day. And that's the thing. You know what? I tell you now, there's so many days where I'm just like, God. Like, oh my. But I'm just like, let's win the day. Let's do it. Let's do something, man. Because when I mean enjoyment of that discipline, I mean afterwards you say, yep. Yeah. Because you know what? Once you get to that goal, there's another one. And that's that. every time you reach that pit, whether that's every day you've ticked it off, you've enjoyed the discipline. So you might have not enjoyed it in that moment, but you enjoyed that. Ah, you, you reap the fruits of your disciplined labor. Exactly. You won't enjoy it in that moment. I tell you now, we know, many people know. You might not enjoy it in that moment. You don't want to lift that day. You don't want to do this. But you, like you said, say that quote again. Reap. You reap the fruits of your disciplined labor. Exactly. You enjoy when you've hit that and then you're going to go do it again. You're planting seeds. The seeds are the actions. The seeds are your discipline, Right then your fruit and vegetables grow. The garden grows. The garden is your character. It's who you're becoming, who you need to become. And then your rewards is when you harvest. You harvest the garden and you reap your rewards, whether it's feelings of satisfaction or fulfillment or it's improvement in, in, in its accolades or it's... Uh, better business or a better lifestyle or better relationships with people. I think that's, that's the equation for me. Definitely. And it's not just for training. People need to remember that. These beyond that. Way beyond that. People need to remember, we've got to look at this as a holistic thing. Our life connects, interrelates together. You know, the way we're feeling, depending on what determinant of health we're talking about, it always interrelates. Mm-hmm. So why not, you know, be disciplined and grow the fruit for all of them? Because mm. then they help each other. And then you can feed that to other people. Your discipline can help other people yeah. find their and grow their garden. And that's a beautiful thing when we can help each other. It is. Reaching a hand out to another. Hey, I've learned how to do this myself. I don't have all the answers, but maybe my garden can help your garden grow. There's a lot of weeds I see. It's going to be tough to grow that beautiful garden, but... You got to feed your mind and feed your body and that garden will grow. 100%.